Why, hello there. Oh, you know. Thought I would visit our resident hero and see what they're up to. Well, as far as I've heard and as far as I've seen, you've been doing some distinctly heroic things as of late. <laughs> I commend you for that. You're looking particularly fantastic today. <laughs> I promise you, I'm not up to anything. I sincerely just wanted to wish you well and see how you were doing. You seem to attract a particular brand of chaos, and yet you always seem to make it out all right. It's utterly fascinating. And inspiring. Again, sounds pretty heroic to me. Do you need assistance? I can help you. Unless that is you're going back to the palace, then I'm afraid you're on your own. <laughs> Excellent. Do you mind if I join you? Perfect. Did you... Did you happen to do something different with your hair recently? Oh, uh, well, um... <clears throat> it uh, looks... It looks nice regardless. Uh, nothing. Uh, nothing is the matter. Uh, forgive me. I'm I'm just feeling a little tired lately. I've been running around like a chicken with my head cut off for the past couple of days. Oh, you know, trying to clear one's name and not get killed by Nadia can make one quite tired. Uh, sorry, yes, I, I'm kidding. Yeah, mostly kidding. There were just some th things I was working on, some loose ends. It's all right. Nothing for you to be concerned about. You have enough on your plate as is, and as much of a hero I think you are, and as much trouble you find yourself miraculously getting out of recently, I, I don't want to throw any kindling on the fire, if you get what I mean. Anyways, here we are. Your home sweet home. And what a lovely home you've made it. Go ahead. Heroes first. What do you mean, acting weird? I... I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, well, um, I... I'm terribly sorry. I, I didn't know that how I was acting was agitating you. I, I was just trying to make you feel nice. I can honestly say with 100% accuracy that I wasn't being facetious with what I was saying. Sometimes it, it must seem that way because, well, I've always been told that my face doesn't lend to honesty or something of the sort. Basically, I, I look like a liar. Thank you. That's very kind of you to say. <clears throat> I mean, the... Well, the whole point of this exercise was for me to make you feel better and, and compliment you. Oh, God, you can't just say things like that. If it's not entirely apparent, I'm not used to people, well, saying nice things about me. I mean, yes, I've heard that the general public still have a fairly good opinion of me even after a whole camp fiasco, but, I mean, people saying stuff to my face. Ugh, yes, like that. Oh, seriously, what sort of compliment hellscape have I opened up for myself? But genuinely, it was supposed to be for you. Not fishing for compliments of my own. You, you do know that. I know that you don't get thanked or complimented or anything as much as you deserve. Especially considering you've kind of become an underling for Nadia. I, I know she wasn't as bad as Lucian, but trust me, I know what it's like to have all these 
responsibilities foisted on you. Especially recently. Even some of them involving me. <laughs> you trust me? Now I feel like I have to ask if you're just saying things to make me feel better. I know it, it, it's simply hard to believe sometimes. Hmm? Oh, yes. Uh, tea would be lovely. W wait, here. I can go ahead and make it. You don't have to... How is it that you always find a way to change the tide in your favor? To turn things around for the better with what looks like no extra effort on your part? I suppose... Maybe I'm just not that nice. Oh, wait, I wasn't fishing for a compliment there. I was just... I... Don't know what I was doing. I suppose that the fact that I thought to compliment you just to make you happy was nice. And the fact that I offered to make tea even though I'm a guest... <laughs> And the fact that I genuinely seem to care about you. Okay, okay, yes, yes. I suppose there is some small, insignificant chance that I'm actually nice. Look, could you please stop with the compliments before I explode? Thank you. <laughs> Gods. Who knew compliment torture was actually a thing? I swear I feel like my face is as red as my hair. Oh, I really have unleashed a monster, haven't I? Well, if you're going to relentlessly fling compliments at me, I'm afraid it's only fair if I do the same to you. Spite is a perfectly sound reason for doing things, especially if the person you're doing it toward is being a little shit about it. <laughs> well, everything I say to you can't be compliments, otherwise it'll all go to your head. No, I think I'll save my relentless complimenting for when you least expect it. <laughs> but, <laughs> in all seriousness, you do know how much you mean and how much you're doing for Vesuvia, right? That, hell, probably a lot of things would be different. You're out there, doing amazing things, finding out what really happened and, well, doing the right thing. And I can't tell you truly how much that means to me. You've become an unexpected relationship that I don't think I deserve sometimes. D don't start, I know. And, well, I just want to say that you're appreciated and, and well loved. Yes? <laughs> uh, yes, uh, right, uh, of course. <laughs> uh, I, I knew that. <laughs> um, you are, <laughs> you are just wonderful. You know that? 